Hi guys, welcome to another short video by Antiques Arena. My name is Walter O'Neill. In this video I'm going to show you um, another of my car boot sale finds. Um, here we have an Indian wall hanging or tapestry. Now I've had quite a few of these in my time. Um, I've had them um, with hundreds of thousands of little sequins hand, in, hand embroidered. I've had them with big crystal stones um, stitched into them as well. This one here is beautifully embroidered with silks and cottons. Um, yeah, so I'll give you a close up and uh, hope you find it interesting. Okay guys, here's the uh, tapestry. Now, I've seen quite a few of these wall hangings. Um, I've had them with elephants, I've had them with gods and Shiva and so on. Um, this one I'm not sure if you'd call them lovers, uh, maybe it was a wedding present or something, but if you look, the uh, the man is actually holding a snake. Uh, the snake comes down and to the tail. Um, looking at his headdress, I don't know if it's ceremonial or if he's someone of uh, importance. Let me zoom in. There are some crystals here there's quite a few of the crystals actually inlaid but they are very small compared to some I've seen and there is some sequin and beadwork um, moving on to um, over to the lady in her dress this is a very Persian um, motif so it's um, a little bit of a mystery it's, it hasn't come into me very long and I haven't had time to do any research on this no idea what the symbolization of this checkered cross is. Um, it has some meaning because he's pointing to it. So I don't know whether they're playing a game or what. Um, however, this little wall hanging came in to me for a fiver from Bessemer Road Car Boot Sale. You can find them on Facebook now. Um, the amount of man has gone into hand stitching all this... Uh, embroidered work it must be astronomical um, it's an absolutely beautiful piece I'll give you a couple of close-ups of different areas just so you can see the sheer amount of work that's gone in to uh, to making it there's nothing out of place everything belongs even this this feels like velvet so you've got velvet and cotton and there's all the different materials. It's almost a patchwork quilt if you like. Absolutely beautiful uh, thing. Let me see if I can show you the reverse. Not a lot to see on the reverse. Let's show you the stitching. Age wise I don't think it has huge age. You know, 20th century. Um, but for the right person, you know, it's got to be 50 to 100 pounds to hang on their wall. If you've uh, followed me on um, YouTube, then you'll be aware that I like to buy different. I don't always know exactly what I'm buying. Um, a lot of the time I'll come home and I'll do my research. This year, I know it's uh, a wall hanging tapestry. Um, clearly looks Indian or that area. Um, and I have had them before but all the actual details the, the relevance of the scene um, the meanings behind it haven't got a clue yet but I will learn them uh, by doing research because there's bound to be others out there or similar pieces feel free to leave a comment if um, it's something you know anything about um, I bought it purely because of the quality the amount of work that's gone into it the love and attention um, Maybe a ceremony, um, wedding proposal, I have, I have genuinely no idea. Um, lovely item. And I've no doubt when I decide to sell her, it will really look beautiful hanging in somebody's home. So, I hope you've enjoyed having a little look at uh, another of my car boot sale finds. Um, I do a video with all my work in stock in one hit. Um, and I do them... I think I've got about 20 videos up now of my car boot sale finds. 
but that's where I show all the working stock. But I select out some of the nicer pieces that I pick up and I do those individually. This happens to be one of those. So, as I was saying, hope you enjoyed seeing it. Um, I've enjoyed showing it to you. Um, if you did enjoy it, please put a like and a share. Don't forget uh, to subscribe uh, to see other videos. You'll find us on Facebook, Antiques Arena. You'll find us on eBay, Antiques Arena Clearance. And you will find us on our own website, antiquesarena.co.uk. Thanks for watching, guys. Until the next time, I'll say bye for now.